This how-to video is going to show you how to import an Eagle PCB into the Cadence PCB tools. So from the import menu, we use translators and then Eagle PCB. So it's asking us to browse for a, a, a .lbr file for a library file or a .brd file for um, an Eagle PCB. So if we click on the help doc, we'll get kind of a PDF that sh goes through the options and what we need to do. So the Eagle and library files are there effectively XML format. That's what generates the, the BRD LB, LBR file, converts it to an XML format. We can then choose the translation options and it goes through kind of some of the limitations and workarounds and things, things you might need to do afterwards. So worthwhile having a look at this document. So let's go and browse for a file. So we'll go to, a, I've got an, an Arduino uh, Wi-Fi version of an Eagle board. Um, I'm going to leave the log file to, to generate and click on translate. So when the translator finishes, it opens the log file, gives me the description of what it's actually done. And I can then zoom in and start to look at my board. So I've got a couple of issues. Um, this is the uh, derived connectivity where effectively the connection might not be in the center of the pad. So we can try running the the, the tool derived connectivity. We'll check the first two options and click on OK and see if that resolves the issues. Otherwise, you might need to manually route these issues. The other option I always recommend is also running a check, database check, enable the three checkboxes and click on check just to check the integrity of the database. There's a view log option to confirm that as well. 